Praise the Lord, brothers and sisters. Everybody say history. history. Say history. history. His story. His, His story. story. His story. God working through the eons of time and through his covenant people. That is how history is made, and that is how history is changed. In the universe, God has given us two great lights in our solar system. One is the sun to rule the day, and one is the moon to rule the night. And so it is with the greatest light that God has ever given to man, Christ and his holy word. Amen. This is the great light that shatters the darkness, not only from the tyranny from without, but the tyranny of sin from within. He is the one who came to break the chains Amen. of bondage. Amen. This is the great light. Amen. But he's also given man a lesser light. And that lesser light is called history. Someone once said, what? If you don't remember history, what? You're bound to repeat it. Well, in some cases, in most cases, that's in the negative. But there is a history here. A history that was accomplished here out of all the states we could have gone to in the United States to bring our vision, our mission, and our message. This is the perfect state in the United States of America because it was here that the very things we are seeking to duplicate in America took place. Brothers and sisters, we need to understand this history. How many know God gave us the Old Testament that we might learn? He said it was written for our admonishment. It was written for our learning. So perhaps we wouldn't make the same mistakes of those who went before us. And if there's good examples in history then we would give our hearts and our lives to follow hard after the Lord and his truth. What did Joshua Glover came when the rescuers showed up and set him free? Glory! Hallelujah! Let God's truth march on in Jesus' mighty name! Oh! <laughs>